So I have a dilemma. Sure. So like a couple weeks ago, I missed and like I had asked you a question about Maddie and you answered it. And for some reason, I still have yet to go back and like actually listen to it. So now go over it again. Whenever I'm trying to like think of like, oh, what do I want to talk about? I don't feel like I can because I feel like I haven't even done the one thing that I asked because I don't even know what the answer was. Okay, well, here's and the I'm thing. like, but I can't ask anything. I wrote a blog post a long time ago. Uh, I think I titled it something along the lines of don't make me repeat myself. Um, because <laughs> many of us, as parents feel that way. Like it pisses us off. We're like, mm -hmm. I already told you that, right? But as a counterpoint, if you are to, this is not a good example of paper. Hold on. I need like paper. Okay. Okay. How about this? This will work. Okay. If you were to take a pencil, this is a pen, but you know, work with me and make a line. That's easy. That's the first time that somebody says something, right? But then you need to go over that exact line without making any deviation. That's a lot harder. And chances are you're going to mess up a little. See, even if you're like really trying, can you see how they don't quite align? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But if you go over it and go over it and go over it and go over it, eventually you start to wear a groove in and now your pen just kind of glides in that space. There's not really any thinking to it. It's become ingrained. That is making new neural connections. That's what that is. So the point of said article was repeat yourself. It's good. There is a, there's, a, there's a time to not repeat yourself. That does not mean you sit on the couch and you're like, stop touching that, stop touching that, stop touching that, stop touching that, stop touching that. You get up and do something, right? But when you're explaining something or teaching something, for sure, repeat yourself. Go over it again later. Practice. Try again. Role play. All of the different ways to repeat that activity so that you can ingrain it. That applies to us too. So if for any reason, maybe you asked a question and you forgot the answer. Maybe you didn't watch the replay. Maybe you were really tired and it just kind of feels like it's gone. Maybe you remember part of it, but not the other part. Maybe it just didn't make sense. Maybe you have new information. For whatever reason, if a topic comes up again, do ask me to repeat myself. That is valuable. That is important. That is part of learning. I'm a fan. 